let's keep things moving with some trending stories. Are you ready? Yeah, this is the first time we've done this this week, so it's I'm, been, I'm ready about it. It's been a while. It. Yes. It's time for Hot, Hot Topics. Topics. Yes. <laughs> Of course, because it has been a while since we've done Hot Topics, it's only right that we start things off talking about Beyonce. I knew it. That's I right. knew it. Beehive Assemble, Netflix and the pop star are teaming up for a documentary. I'm, so excited. Yeah. Now, if you're a Beyonce fan, you know that she rarely lets people into her life. So this documentary that Netflix is going to air on the 17th of this month is going to go behind the scenes of her historic Coachella performance last year in which she paid homage to historically black colleges yep. and universities. I also saw some sweet little snippets of all her kiddos, which you really haven't seen the twins since they were really little babies. And so this is very exciting. Um, I've seen some behind the clips of Beyonce work ethic yeah crazy like she's super focused so mm -hmm. this like us really when we get here to get yeah. ready for this show totally mm -hmm. so I'm very excited about this of course I did ask for the day off I haven't heard back from <laughs> the power that be yet I saw that email you were like this day I'm off I asked I, yeah. you know you never we'll know see. that's right <laughs> uh, the first number one seed out a year ago is the last one standing mm -hmm. this year if you didn't catch it last night the Virginia Cavaliers outlasted Texas Tech 85-77 in overtime to win their first national title in school history. The Cavaliers were out for revenge after making history last year as the first ever number one seed to fall to a 16 seed, a big wahoo to the Cavaliers. Uh, you know, and Jill last night tried to bring this up and said, it's a comeback story. And I'm like, well, it is, but this is a whole different team than okay. they were a year ago. Okay, so I like, it. Uh, I, I like that they have sort of um, avenged what happened to them last year. But I don't know if I would call it a comeback story. It happened in a totally different season with a different team. Also, if you remember yesterday, we had uh, Picture of Nations Alyssa that's right. Orange yes. on here. And she's from Virginia. She so was, she was saying that she was rooting for that's them. Right. And she said they say Wahoo. Wahoo, wahoo yeah. So Wahoo to Virginia. Wahoo. Yeah. Big Wahoo. Nice. Yeah. All right, well, here's an update. Actress Felicity Huffman pleading guilty and apologizing for her role in a massive college scandal admission. Uh, of course, she paid about $15,000 to get her daughter set up for the ACTs. <sighs> this story. I know. Mm -mm -mm. Keeps going. She did issue a statement saying that she admits all guilt and is ashamed and of the pain that she has caused her family and the education community. Now details of the plea deal were released on Monday. Now the government is recommending prison time for Huffman but far less than the 20 year maximum sentence carried by the mailed fraud charge. A $20,000 restitution and a uh, 12 months of supervision release are also listed as sentencing guidelines. The government does not plan to charge Huffman with any other charges. Interesting. Slap on the wrist. Yeah, slap on the wrist. What <laughs> about Aunt wrist. Becky? What's happening with, uh, I don't do know, know yet. Waiting for that to come out? I yeah. don't know yet. Waiting for that one to come out. She was in court as well, so I don't know. I know. We'll try to keep you updated with yes. that once we know. Yes, because I'm totally into it. Yeah. It's interesting. Uh, the remaining Avengers appear to lay out their plan for Thanos mm -hmm. in a new clip from Avengers Endgame with Captain Marvel now on their side. They just may have a chance when Endgame opens April 26. Everybody's talking about this yep. huge. The huge buildup of this movie. I just expect, well, our producer Taylor, she had a great point. She said, well, her and her husband are going to go and go ahead and see it early. She said, because... You have to stay off the internet if you don't. If you don't go see it right away, That's you a have good to point. stay off the internet because it's going to be flooded with spoilers. Yes. And so she's just like, we're just going to go and see it early. I do want to see it. Yeah. I probably will. I just don't know when. Uh, but I don't, same. I don't mind the spoilers, though, because I'm not like a huge Marvel fan. Right. I so I don't catch mind them. But I can totally understand. I got to catch up first. I feel like uh, yeah. last movie I saw was like the original <laughs> Iron Man. <laughs> so I got I got a bunch to right. watch. I need to go to one of those marathons. Well, a lot of people 